guess what? What? It is I, Rubex. What is happening, Is Ripper X? Well, some good news on the Darkfall front. Darkfall Rise of Agon announced today on their site that they've officially acquired the license for Darkfall Online through Adventuring. Now, currently, Big Picture Games and the Rise of Agon team are accepting alpha signups on their website. I will post that below this video. And they say that in the coming weeks, they will be integrating their payment and account management systems in preparation for their alpha launch. They also said that they'll be releasing detailed information on their pricing structure, development schedule, and roadmap over the coming weeks. So this means we will now have two projects to look forward to. Again, for those of you who are in the dark to Darkfall, essentially the original developer Adventuring who made Darkfall Online sold the license to not one but two companies. One being Uber Games, who's releasing Darkfall New Dawn, and the lads over at Big Picture Games with their project Darkfall Rise of Agon. Again, this is the same source code. AV is essentially licensing it out. This is a good thing for fans because the original Darkfall Online, which by the way was one of my all-time favorite MMOs in the history of the world, besides Dark Tide, was closed down because Adventuring thought they could technically make a simpler Darkfall and call it Darkfall and Holy Wars. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying DFUW was bad. I enjoyed my time in the game and had some great memories, but it in no way compares to the original Darkfall Online. So with that being said, in the coming months, we shall look forward to two new Darkfall projects being brought to the table. I'm interested to see both pricing models as well as the most important actually jumping into a working build. Once I can get actually into the build of both projects, I'll be very excited when that actually happens. I know that's going to happen eventually, I don't know what the timing is. Again, having a source code and a good team that cares about the game means a lot of new potential content and tweaks and fixes to this game. Excited to see it come back on both fronts. Definitely excited that Rise of Agon and the guys at Big Picture Games got their license officially. So, two projects coming soon, guys. What do you guys think of Darkfall Online coming back officially? Will you stick with the Rise of Agon on the Big Picture dev team? Or are you a fan of the Uber 3 team and their new Dawn project? Or will you try both projects and decide for yourself? Personally, for me, I'm absolutely giddy about this. I'm not too sure if both can survive, though. I don't know. I guess we'll see what happens. It's really going to depend on the players. Darkfall is one of those games where it really needs players to survive. And when there is a player base, my goodness, the game is amazing. So I'm going to do my best to keep you guys in the loop with both projects. And of course, all relevant links and information for both projects will be below this video. Uh, we do have more information at MMORPG.com. A lot of discussion on it. So definitely check out that. I'll post the link below as well for that. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. Highly appreciate your time as always. My name is Ripper See you guys soon. Peace. Make sure to level up your MMO knowledge by visiting MMORPG.com, subscribing to our YouTube channel, and by following us on social media. To catch up on the week's biggest MMO news, watch our latest MMO FTW. And to see if there's a better MMO out there for you, watch one of our latest First Impressions videos. Thanks for watching.